Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Fallout 4, and uh, the game is frozen for whatever reason. But um, I'm going to be showing you guys today another Power Armor location as well. Um, it probably won't be included into the title, but as well as some tokens uh, for those book returns, these things right here, which we will go ahead and use uh, in just a second. But you're going to want to come... Oh, I should probably show you where I am. Um, I'm right here at the Revere Beach Station. Over to the right is Nahant Wharf. To the left, County Crossing, National Guard Training, Satellite Array, Easy City Downs. Here is the Boston Airport and the Pridwin. And then up north, you got the Slog, Greentop Nursery, Breakheart Banks. Uh, and so this is where I am. It's the arcade area here. Uh, you'll have to kill a bunch of raiders. I did that just so we wouldn't have to worry about it. There are some pool balls here, and you guys know... I gotta collect those pool balls when I find them because I wanna get. I gotta get two complete sets because uh, I have two tables in my mansion that has now become a laggy mess that I need to clean up. Uh, but up here in this trunk, master lock pick required. I went ahead and picked that for you guys. Uh, there is nothing really in that duffel bag. Um, but in here, you can see 16 book return tokens. Uh, then there's some other different stuff in here that you might as well collect. But the 16 book return tokens are the things that you want to get out of that. Uh, there are, are some book return tokens on uh, some of these raiders. Uh, you will possibly find some on them. I think it's just random. I found a few, but if you go ahead and you go see three book return tokens on this guy, um, I'm not sure if it's just specific to different areas that they will have them on them or if it's um, just random throughout the map, but this is the first time I've seen them on anybody. See, there's four there. Uh, so this also pertains to the book token. Since I'm actually finding some in the video, I might actually put that in the title. But I know these guys over here that I already looted, these guys had book return tokens on them. Um, I already looted them for those, but they did have them. Uh, and then there's just guys all over this area. Um, and so you can go ahead and clean them out. You can get your book return tokens. I probably have like 20 something now um, after that. Uh, but let's go ahead and get the power armor. It is right over here. Uh, you will have this person right here, just a raider waster. Just They'll be wandering around the boardwalk here. Um, when I first encountered uh, this one, uh, they were they were right here. Like, I don't know if they just patrol this area, but this is they were back in this area here. I don't know if they do head down to the beach and patrol or whatever they're doing. Um, but, uh, they will come after you, so you don't really have to worry about that once you find them. But this is a full set, I believe. Uh, so we'll go ahead and take it off. Got five book return tokens on it, so it might even be up to 30. Uh, but there is, uh, the, co this is not the Raider Power Armor, this is Combat Armor, you don't want that. You don't want any of this, really. You want this right here, Raider Power Helmet, Raider 2 left leg, Raider Power 2 right leg, just re regular power, left arm and right arm, as well as torso. Uh, so you've got um, you've got a full set of Raider Power Armor, another full set, which I am extremely happy about. Let me throw something back on to so I can be underweight. Okay, so there is a book return right here. Um, let me quick check and see if there's like a desk. If there's a quick desk, maybe I'll try to grab up. But okay, I thought there would be some tokens maybe in one of these. But there is not, so we'll just roll with what tokens I have. If there's nothing in there, then obviously I won't get it, but this is kind of like book return as well. So go ahead and use the terminal. This one's all bloody, but return, spend tokens, here we go. So you want to spend tokens. Here you can spend book return tokens on any price you like. Uh, I have 36, so you can see fragmentation grenades cost 15, 20 for combat knives, 10 for rad X. 10 millimeter ammo, 50 tokens, fusion core is 50 tokens, and a stim pack is 10 tokens. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and just get a stim pack to show you guys. So you go ahead and you buy it, go ahead and claim it. It'll remove the tokens from your inventory. Then I believe all you do is go ahead and look down here, activate the, not, not the terminal activate them or does it just add it i thought you might have to activate that but i don't think you do i think you just get it added um but that's that's kind of the book return terminals they're kind of cool they don't really serve too much of a purpose though uh so i wouldn't really worry about those uh, but that is um another raider power armor location uh just want to let you guys know in this video i am going to i'll probably be saying it in most of the videos just to let people know because not everybody watches all the videos because some of you have obviously already found some of this loot and whatnot but 
Uh, like I said in the comments to someone, I am going to start doing some Let's Builds on this game once I beat it. Currently, right now, I am just going back and beating the game uh, to get all the achievements for, you know, siding with the Railroad, siding with uh, the Brotherhood of Steel, and siding with the Institute. I accidentally sided with the Minutemen once, which was stupid because it's not an achievement. Uh, to have the Minutemen help you. Um, if someone needs that guide, let me know. I can just show you guys what point you want to save at. And uh, should be good to go from there. But that is going to do it for this video, guys. But keep on the lookout. I am going to start doing some Let's Builds. Um, I have a ton of locations unlocked. I've only built at... Uh, uh, the Boston Airport, the Mansion Showcase I already showed you, which I will update later on in the near future um, because I am currently adding stuff. Hey, look, there's more dog armor here that I didn't even know, as well as a spiked muzzle that I don't really think you want to put on your dog. But there's some more dog armor uh, in the video. Um, but like I was saying, uh, keep an eye out for those. I'm probably going to be doing Sanctuary first, just doing a large kind of city-esque build there. And then moving on to maybe uh, finishing off like the uh, cottage type areas um, and the the nicer areas where I can like make a nice little um, settlement and whatnot. Uh, and so I just want to let you guys know that so you can keep an eye out uh, for those videos and maybe um, maybe you're looking for that type of stuff. I know there's some guys that have done like live streams of it, but. Um, with me doing it in a video setting, not a live stream, I should be able to give you guys a more detailed um, explanation of what I'm doing. Um, the glitch is still not patched for unlimited um, unlimited area, like unlimited building space. There we go, that's the right word. Uh, unlimited building space, so I don't have to worry about that. Uh, because currently I can still mess around with that. But that is going to do it for uh, this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in my next episode. Peace out.